Well, it's the day after. Battery ran out last night, so didn't really film much at the restaurant, unfortunately. But it was a lovely meal. It's a buffet, Tex-Mex star buffet. It was really nice. Anyway, we're back in Magic Kingdom. Uh, Magic Kingdom. That's Florida. Uh, Disneyland Park. This morning, bright and early, rope dropping, armed with ponchos, because the rain is back. Megan's got a parade this morning at about 11 o'clock. So she's off doing the rehearsals for that at the minute. And we're just coming in, getting a couple of rides done and then getting a good spot hopefully for the parade. Watching her in the parade and then she's free for the rest of the day. So we're gonna head over to the other park this afternoon, head over to studios, see what we can get done in there. The weather looks brighter this afternoon, so hopefully it'll stay that way and we can get the fireworks done this evening. And that's the rough plan for the day. So let's go and see what we uh, can get done this morning. The castle still looks beautiful even in the rain, look. We're gonna see if Holly's had enough breakfast to get the sword out today. See if she's had a Weetabix. Anything? Not budging? No? Ugh. All right, let's get on Peter Pan's flight. Not done that yet so far, so let's uh, let's give this a whirl. You okay, you two? You okay, Hal? another ride on the uh, what's this called carousel thank you so here we are give us a wave Holly Next up is Snow White. No idea what this ride's all about, so I guess we'll find out. No sign of the rain letting up just yet. You're singing tweets, are you? Yeah. I'm singing the Star Wars theme song in tweets. The Star Wars theme song is a bird. Oh yeah. It does, it, and it's got the music as well, hasn't it? <laughs> She's 
she's determined to give us that apple, isn't she? Those crocs aren't scary, they're no teeth. Another new ride, never been on this, Pinocchio. We didn't go on Snow White either. No, Snow White was a new one for us to be fair. It's not quite Snow White in the uh, Seven Dwarfs Mine Train, but uh, it's still a nice ride. Oh no? Stromboli? Yeah. yeah. I just remember it from the story of Pinocchio. There he is, look, Stromboli. On the side. Made out candy canes, isn't it? That's epic. Oh, that was loud, wasn't it? Scientific. I want to say Einstein, but that's Back to the Future. That's the dog in Back to the Future. It's definitely not that, but... Oh, what's it called? We had to Google it. It's Figaro. <laughs> oh, looks like the dragon might be open. Let's go see this dragon. I can hear it breathing. There it is.
Oh, that's a big jewellery shop. All the different tiara tiaras, Holly. Look at these ones in there, very special. Wow, look at the glass slipper at the back. Huh? Is it meant to be like potions? Do you think? Oh no. Oh, do you fill the ones with them? Oh, I see. Oh, here we are. There's a bit of a thing here. So we just got in, got in position waiting for the parade. Megan and Ava in the uh, pre-parade parade this morning. So we just got a good, hopefully a good spot just in front of the castle here for when they come past. Just managed to squeeze in a couple of rides while waiting. We got on Space Mountain just then. No sign of the rain relenting though. Disneyland Park is pleased to welcome today as part of our Disney Performing Arts on Stage program, Stagecoach, Dance the Dream Performance from the United Kingdom. There she is, there she is, there she is. Right here, right here, right here. Such a cool experience that. As a major Disney geek to watch your own little kid, little girl, in the parade. Amazing. Just go walk in to get a bottle of water and then we'll get back in position and watch the main parade next.
right, so after the two parades and a bit of lunch at Rainforest Cafe, we are heading back towards Disney Studios Park for the afternoon. Still not stopped raining. I think believe starting to think we're cursed in terms of holidays and rain, but never mind. So yeah, full afternoon in studios. And then similar tomorrow morning. Megan's finished all her duties for stagecoach, so she's completely free now, so she can relax and unwind. Here's Meg here's Holly. So let's have an afternoon of fun in Disney Studios. There's the uh, train station just behind us, and there's Disneyland Park over there. Really close together, actually. I'm really impressed with how everything's so accessible and handy from uh, from, your, from the hotels. That's really cool. Oh, I'm looking forward to doing a bit of shopping. Should we do a bit of shopping in a bit, Meg? Yes. I fancy a bit of shopping. No, in a little bit. Let's get some rides done first. Um, I don't mind. So what we're we doing first? Should we do Toy Story a bit first, or the Avengers bit first? All right, that's a fair comment. Yeah, should we do that then? All right. Toy Story Land first then. Precious Coaster. Precious Coaster is there. Actually, it's only a 15 minute. Oh no, it's 40. It's a, oh, single. No, it's single rider. We could all go single riders. <laughs> yeah. Well, what do we think? Are we, should we get Precious Coaster done while we're here? It's, it's always going to have the biggest queue this place. First ride in Disney Studios is Crush's Coaster. Kids have gone on uh, Slinky. Trying to see if we can get them on the uh, RC racer over there, but uh, I think it might be proving a little bit too big and steep for some of them. We'll see.
Megan trying to look all cool. Let's see what pose she uh, strikes next. <laughs> I'm gonna go and check out the queue for Remy's. I know. Oh, it's just like being in France. Oh yeah. Oh, 20 minutes it is on this now. It's not too bad. Bistro Chez okay, Remy. We could be in France now, here, couldn't we? I think that was a whoosh moment there. I think that went over red. <laughs> <laughs> You ready for Remy's girls?
cher ami. A bientôt et bon appétit. Et Mino oh. Oh, there's the restaurant, Chez Remy. At the end of the ride, you can actually see into the restaurant a little bit. Oh, you get macarons here. Oh, can we get a crate? Or oh, pretzels there. Chocolate covered strawberries and stuff. It's in this one. Bar. <laughs> <laughs> I love how you said it, said it in a French accent there. I see vino. Oh, got fresh poured coffee in there. I'm not going to lie, I'm a little bit tempted. So, is it me and you and Diana? Yeah. And then Mummy can go on it after. Yeah. Oh. Are you sure we should do this for five minutes? Yeah, we'll be fine. No, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with going on it five minutes after eating, is there? You're going to listen for us. Are you sure you don't want to come on it, Hall? Yes, I'm sure. Yes, you're sure. Keep going down, Mike, a bit. You unlock this door with a key of imagination. Beyond it is another dimension. A dimension of sound. A dimension of sight. A dimension of mind. You're moving into a land of both shadow and substance, of things and ideas. You've just crossed over into the Twilight Zone. <laughs> and the glitter of a bustling young movie town at the height of its golden age, the Hollywood Tower Hotel was a star in its own right, a beacon for the show business elite. Now, something is about to happen that will change all that. for a different kind of introduction. This, as you may recognize, is a maintenance service elevator, still in operation, waiting for you. We invite you, if you dare, to step aboard, because in tonight's episode, you are the star. And this elevator travels directly to the Twilight Zone. Meg, what did you think of that? It was better. I think that was better than the, Disney, the Florida one. Yeah, was, I really do. Like, like, I think the drops were a little bit, they came at you a bit quicker and um, a bit more unexpected, shall we say. I definitely think I prefer that one. It's good. Le there's a lot less storytelling. Oh, there's Pim Kitchen, that's where we're going tonight. Um, it was, there's a lot, bit, a lot less storytelling. The one in Florida, ten, it, there's a bit more of a, of a tale to it, story to it, as you driving through the ride but um, this was much more just about the drops but excellent really good fun wasn't it Meg yeah. you're going on again soon with mummy aren't you 
Um, so I think we're going to do web slingers, aren't we? Gone through. Comment ça va Je suis Peter Parker. Ici chez Web, on a accès à une super technologie, comme le vibranium du Wakanda ou ce puits d'extraterrestre dément. On a les particules de pluie. As you may have noticed, the spider bots are multiplying and consuming everything in sight. Unless Spider-Man can stop them, they will destroy the entire Avengers campus. Malgré ce que vous voyez là, les Spider-Man ont été créés pour être des assistants robotiques. Mais ils dévorent actuellement tout ce qu'ils rencontrent et se multiplient en plus à la main. Si rien ne fait, ils vont finir par anéantir le campus des Avengers. Mais bon. I'm going to get your, your glasses home. Are you ready to shoot some webs, Meg? Go. Achoo! Achoo! Got to complete with the sound effects. J'assigne les profils de couleurs individualisées. Calibrage des lanceurs d'étoiles. You there, Spider-Man? Je suis là, chérie. Vous en avez vu? Meg actually won that, that's Meg's score. There's me and there's Helen. I know. Kung Fu fighting obviously wasn't good enough. <laughs> well, I ditched the uh, I ditched the camera after one round on the uh, web slingers because it was slowing me down. Megan won, didn't you? You won our our, uh, our car. I even with one arm managed to beat Helen. <laughs> Her kung fu fighting skills at web slinging didn't, didn't nice. cut it. <laughs> that was actual audio from the ride. And uh, we're just coming to Avengers Assemble. Meg's been ultra brave coming on this. This will be her biggest ride ever. But she'll smash it. Can't be re believe a ride like this is five minutes wait time. That's tremendous. Oh, you're easily tall enough. Yeah. You're not getting out of it that easily by saying you're too you're not tall enough. You can't pull that you can't pull the fast one. The worst is you have a mind to assist in the mission. Peut-être Star Machin et Sigardin? Oh, je aussi. Energizing. Allez, on avance. Occupez toutes les places disponibles. On n'a plus beaucoup de temps. Analyse des panneaux escamotables. Retractable panels analyzed. Recalibrate the sous-system. Subsystems recalibrated. Now, balance the source from the repulsor. Propulsors augmented. Consider your Well, that was an awesome uh, ride as well. Um, and now it is time for dinner. We booked in Pim Kitchen. So we're just heading over there now to, uh, yeah, to eat another buffet. Let's go and see what this one's all about.
Now we're going in. Oh, thank you. Oh, a fresh pasta bar. That looks good. Giant pretzel with pastrami, cheese, fresh bits. The meats, the dessert options. Giant Oreo cake. Well, after a meal at Pim Kitchen, which was lovely. The sun has made an appearance. It's only taken till half past eight at night, but there it is. The sun, I think we've taken a wrong turn here, folks. I don't remember coming down this way, do you? I, th I think we've, yeah, I think we've come the wrong way. Yeah, the sun's taken till half past eight at night to make an appearance, but it's finally here and it is only spitting at least, which is better than it has been. All day. Flashback to the Disney cruise there with Flo's Cafe. And Tomata. And Luigi's Casa Della Tires. These were all restaurants on the um, cruise ship, in there On the Disney cruises. Yeah. No, I remember around the pool. Like the quick service places at the pool. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I think we're going to go on this toy soldier drop, parachute drop thing. Next. Maybe the U1. And then maybe the RC racer one over there. I think we need to try and persuade Holly to get on that though. I'm going to walk under Buzz's crotch. Salutations. Je suis Buzz Lightyear, Ranger de l'espace. is RC Racer. Holly's bravery of going on that isn't going to stretch to this though he says, she says. Are you 
Well, it seems none of us are getting an RC racer because uh, we didn't realise this park shuts at nine and it's just ticked nine o'clock, so they've actually closed it for the night. So we're going to head through to Disneyland Park again. Get a few more rides done before the fireworks in there. You're gonna try space, aren't you? So Hyper Space Mountain. I'm gonna die like after a bit, after a bit of big thunder. Yeah. And before, and I need to go to touch All right. One well, last go on Thunder Mountain. Well, last go for this trip anyway. Cheers, everybody. Thank you very much. Oh, you wanted water. There's, found, there's some water fountains literally just there. <laughs> so we just had a bit of a mad run round trying to get on a load of rides. Big Thunder was down unfortunately for the night, so we couldn't get on that. We got candy floss. So yeah, we got some candy floss. You keep me awake. For the sugars. We've got some uh, bubbles for the fireworks. We've been on Space Mountain, we've been on Star Tours, haven't we? Just a quick run round while the camera was charging up again and then we're just about to go and find a spot for the fireworks and uh, drone drone show.
inner child needs an invitation to come out and play. This is your invitation to dream. Just a 
It was. This was your entire childhood. Which room, France? And of course, on the final day, the day we go home, we have clear skies. Ain't that just typical? So yeah, get the uh, get the setting off on the bus about was it about one o'clock? So um, just had a nice breakfast back at Sequoia Lodge. 
and we are heading into the parks for a couple of hours. Then we're going to head to studios first, do a couple of rides, then into Disneyland parks for Disneyland Park for an hour or so, another couple of rides, and then finish with a bit of shopping in Disney Village before coming back and getting the bus. Can't remember where I finished filming last night. To be honest, fireworks probably. Fireworks and drone show were awesome. Um, got there a little bit late, so we didn't have much of a, a good spot. But um, it was the the drones, especially, were very impressive. Fireworks were good, but drone was very impressive. I've got to say. Here we are. Back in studios. Hi right, Meg. Yeah. How do you feel after your, all your performances, your I parade? Feel good and sad because I want to do it all. You, again. You, you really enjoyed it, didn't you? Yeah. If they do it again in a couple of years, should we do it again? Yeah. Definitely. Sign me up. Sign you up. So Holly's pick for the uh, first ride of the day. It's the parachute drop, Toy Story, Toy Soldier parachute drop. She uh, didn't want to go on it yesterday, but did and loved it, and she wants to go on it again. Are you going to put your hands up, Holly? Put your hands up. Well, do it again, do it again, do it again. Hands up, Bob. Both of them, both of them, hands up. All the way up. Go, go, you go. Hey. I love this. Do you want to try Tower and Tower? No. <laughs> Enjoy that? Yeah. So Tower Tower next. No! Not Tower Tower! Alright, hopefully I'll see you race the time. Seeing as how we tried to get on it last night, but we were a minute late and it had shut. Oh, five minutes, I can live with that. Bonjour. I love how the fact the Q system is even a scale extra track. <laughs> Parts of cars on the sprues. So we've just been on and uh, done a child swap. These two didn't really, really want to do this one. And the rest have just gone on. Megan's gone on for round two. So let's we'll see if we can catch them in, in flight. There they are at the back. <laughs> Meg, what do you think? You've been on it twice, what do you reckon? It's good. We went on it. I went on for the end of it. It's good, isn't it? All right, heading over to Avengers again. Get one last ride on Avengers. And then hopefully Tara Terra. Avengers now, yeah. It'll be the last time we get on this, this trip, yeah. 
do Avengers and do Tara Terra, and then we'll go over to I Disneyland like for a park. Yeah. And then we'll get uh, over to Disneyland Park for an hour or so before we go and do a bit of shopping. And then after shopping, it'll be time to go for the bus, won't it? And then sleep for 12 hours. <laughs> that was an Avenger there, Captain America. Well, wow, it's the new Captain America. The official Captain America is retired, and that's who's replacing him. Yeah, it's web slingers. I think I think it's I think plenty of people are going on it. It's just luckily it's a very fast turnaround. They can get people on and off very quickly. Whereas rides like that um, parachute drop, um, they can get a lot of people on, but it takes a long time to get people on and off. So the queue backs up. Whereas this, it's very fast getting people on and off, and it's a fast ride. So I think uh, I think that's why it. I think that's why the queue's a bit more manageable, perhaps. That's my theory, anyway. I could be wrong, but that's my theory. Oh, that car wasn't there yesterday. Is it a pro? Yeah. Allez, on avance. Occupez toutes les places disponibles. On n'a plus beaucoup de temps. Analyse des panneaux escalotables. Alright, we're leaving Studios Park for the last time this trip. Got about an hour or so to go and uh, get in Disneyland Park. Get a few more rides before heading back uh, towards the bus. Find some shopping. Oh, last time walking into here this trip. The only saving grace is we only have to wait till October and we're back in Florida, so it's not not too long between the end of July and uh, mid October, so not too long to wait. So me and Holly are coming on Orbitron while the rest go on Big Thunder. Not done this this trip, have I? Yeah, you did, but I've not yet. It's really fun. You should let's get in first because we made a mistake in the I love the fact you've just said that on camera. That's how I drive the car, is it? Yeah, you only have one. It's like that. Yeah, you only put one hand down. Hi, Daddy. Daddy, we go really high. It's funny today. Yeah. See why I wanted to go on it. Hey, we're gonna go another. A bit of video from around now. It's really cool up here, isn't it? I'm hair blowing in your face. No, it's alright. Oh, last look back at Space Mountain for this trip. We had a fun ride on uh, Orbitron, didn't we, girl? Yeah. That was nice, that. Nice, a nice final ride, that. We're heading back to Main Street now. 
maybe getting a treat of some sort and then I head back to the uh, to Disney Village for some shopping and then unfortunately it'll be time for us to get on our uh, on our bus and head home just sound like there's a little bit of a parade of some sort going on though the parade ended up actually being the big parade the main parade we got a little bit of a cheeky view of that as well. It's not a trip to Disney without a walk around world of Disney. We're just waiting, waiting on the bus now for the journey home. Sad, sad face.